recording is good. Hello, guys. Good morning, Mauricio and Hugo. Good morning, teacher. How are you? I will take the attendance list and then we're going to start, okay? Okay, guys. So the purpose of today's class is to practice a lot. You, I don't know if you know, but today is your last class of basic one. So tomorrow you are going to be basic two. Okay, that's why uh, I prepared a special class for you. It's fully practice. I promise you, fully practice. Can, can you see it? Yes. Okay, thank you. So this is your class. I will, I, yes, I will share with you a PDF on WhatsApp. And you will have access to this PPT. Now, you, I suppose in pairs because you are just a four. So you are going to have a review together. It's about the five units. So this is um, positive adjectives. Yes, no questions. WH words. Preposition of place, and this is preposition of time. The first one, I, I would put it here. So this is preposition of place. And the next one is time. This can Okay, so place and time. Here you have a frequency adverbs, the rules of the third person, and also the weather. This is just vocabulary, okay? Because all of this, you will use all of this in our practice, okay? So I'm gonna share with you, just give me a second. I will erase this. I will download and I will stop share. Give me a second.
Wait for me. <clears throat> I'm going to share with you the link and you will have to, to have a review. Like, oh, this is a function for this, this is a, this work for this, and so on. You will have, or you will have to do, or you will have to give an explanation, okay? Together. Let me know when you receive this uh, PPT. Do you receive it? Yes, no. Guys, I'm talking with you. Did you receive the the PPT? Yes or no? Yes, in WhatsApp. Yes, in WhatsApp. Yes. Okay, so open it. It's in a PDF. So open it now. You are just three. So I am going to send you in break up in a breakup room together, and you will have the review. Okay. Do you have any doubt? Yes. No. Mm -hmm. Oh, so Maria is here. Guys, I don't know why you are so shy today and I am talking with you. Okay, if you don't have any doubt about the activity, I'm going to send you. And that's all, okay? Go. sobre los, los
practicing. Entonces dijo que es como una práctica la que vamos a hacer. ¿verdad? Sí. Entonces todavía tienen dudas. Todavía tienen dudas. Sí. Entonces, todavía todavía tienen tienen dudas porque pregunté si tenían dudas y nadie respondió. Si tienen Entonces, dudas, por favor, hablen. Porque si no, en este momento en el que tienen que practicar, están perdiendo el tiempo. Preguntando qué es lo que van a hacer. Por eso me tardé allá preguntando si tenían dudas. Si tienen dudas, digan, yes, I have. Y yo con gusto les vuelvo a explicar la clase. Lo único que tienen que hacer es volver. Es como un repaso. Pero como es la última, es la última... Que el último repaso de este básico 1, ustedes lo van a hacer. Ustedes van a hacer su propio repaso. Alejandro explica un tema, Hugo explica otro tema, y así se van. ¿Ok? Sí. Ok. Uh -huh. eh, teacher, lo siento, que sé que yo como ando trabajando no puedo estar completamente en la clase, quizás voy a tener que, que hacerlo luego. If not, uh, you can work together and Hugo is just hearing. Sorry. Mean? I don't listen. Si le parece, pueden trabajar en grupo con María y Mauricio y, eh, para que Alejandra también tenga su oportunidad de hablar y usted solo está escuchando el repaso. Está bien, voy okay. a, a estar escuchando entonces solamente. Ok. Eh, when you cannot talk in the meeting, please let me know because, uh, uh, you know, now I can, I can know that you are going to just be just hearing. Como la rutina diaria, no es eso, pienso yo. Hello, guys. The, no. Remember that the review is in English. And also, eh, Alejandra will be working with you because eh, Hugo cannot talk right now, so he will be just hearing, okay? Repeat, please, teacher, por favor. No, 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 no escuché. Eh, Alejandra will be working with you. Because Hugo can attack. Well, Hugo will be just hearing. Or listening. You. No, todo está por acá. Vamos a hablar sobre algún tema. ¿De cuál quieres hablar? Eh, no escuché lo último que dijo ahí. Eh, 
Uh, I wake up at six o'clock. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You are going to have a review. Like I have a, or like I explain in, for example, I, I will share the person, the, the screen. Give me a second. I shared with you a, a PPT, right? Uh, in WhatsApp. So this is your review. You have he here the topics. This is possessive adjectives. This is yes, no questions. They are a WH words. Those are preposition of place, preposition of time, frequency adverbs, the role of third person, and just vocabulary of the weather. So what you have to do is have a review. You are going, for example, Alejandra will explain the positive adjective. When do we use it? Uh, examples. Then, uh, for example, Maria will explain yes, no question. The structure, the examples, because remember, this is a review. And this is the end of basic one. So that's why it's supposed that you know all these uh, topics. So that's why you will. Uh, explain the review, okay? The topic. Got it? Okay. Okay. Okay, who, who will start with positive adjectives? The positive adjectives. Who will explain the positive attitudes? In positive attitudes, we use personal pronouns, so it and positive adjectives. And positive pronouns, subject so are I, you, he, she. If we you there and possessive adjectives we use we my you his her it our all our you they example the possessive adjectives is my car you you dog his his book and sunglasses it's it's your dog um, computer their lunch. Okay, and thank you. And when do we use positive adjectives? Or or for what? When when think is nuestro as as nuestro. To express possessions, my car, mm -hmm. my dog, my house. Okay. okay. Are you clear with this topic, guys? Yes. No. Did you understand it? Yes. 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 Okay. Now you will uh, explain the next one. Who wants to explain this one? Maria or Mauricio? 
Teacher, es que no entiendo la palabra explain. Explain es explicar. Oh. Uh -huh. Do you speak it English? Oh, that's a very good example. Uh, example. Uh, okay, if not, Mauricio, explain the topic. <clears throat> Yes or no question. A structure. Auxiliary plus subject plus verb plus information plus question mark. Um, example. Do you want ice cream? Does your sister play soccer? Do they, do they work together? Um, for yes or no question, um, only only answer to options. Two options. Yes or no. Yeah, excellent. Very good job. Can you give me an example? Mm. Do you, do you drink coffee early? Excellent. So what about the next one? Let me see. Maria, when do we use these um, words? It work? When do we use or uh, why uh, do we use this? words to uh, where is the um, question um, where is the house example oh that's a very good example so we use where for places yes right where is your house? So you are talking uh, about a place. Mm -hmm. Where is your house? When do we use why? To talk about what? Why is the, why is the question? The, um, this is for reasons. <laughs> why are you so sad why are you sleeping okay this is a for reasons to ask for a reason okay okay next, next one what a uh, what the Use um, what's that example? Uh huh. So you are talking about things and actions. Option. Uh huh. What are you drinking? You are talking about the 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 thing. What are you drinking? Maybe water chocolate, coffee. So what it's used for things and actions. What about when? When, when is the time? Excellent, can you give me an example? Um, Mm 
no remember. Oh, an example could be, uh, when do you why do you want to buy the t-shirt? When? Maybe on Saturday, on Sunday? When? It's for time. And how? When you see example, no. oh, how how is a use for manners or ways to do something? How can I drive? Or how can I cook this uh, food? It's a way to do it. Okay. okay. And finally, who? When do we use who? Who is? Quien? Mm -hmm. So it's talking about people, right? Okay. So can you give me an example? I, I will help you. Who is your boyfriend? This is an example because I am asking for your boyfriend. I want to know who is your boyfriend, okay? Okay. Okay, thank you. Alejandra, help me explain the uh, okay. preposition of please. Not all of them, it's not necessarily. Repeat. Please. You don't you don't have to explain every point of this, like at a point, top, bottom. You don't have to do this, just general. Explain me when do we use at, in, and on. Okay. What you remember, okay? Okay. We use at a point, for example. Uh, I go at uh, at school seven o'clock. Mm. And we use in when in we are we are place inside. Inside, inside, oh. Oh. for example, in, in the back, mm -hmm. in my class is in a case. In okay. a case. Excellent. Mm. We use on in when super superface surface surface. For example, my 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 max face in the dex. My computer is in the desk, on the desk. On the desk, makes sense. On the desk. Mm. Okay, okay. Well, thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, remember, we use it always uh, for school, university, oh, home, God. and work, okay? It, this is for app. And it's a, also for territories like countries in El Salvador, okay. in Brazil, in the United States. And we also use on 
for a, for a, a social media, okay? On YouTube, mm -hmm. on Facebook, on Instagram, okay? So okay. now, Mauricio, explain me what you remember of preposition of time. At and on. <clears throat> we use at for uh, times of the day, mm -hmm. meal times, holidays, an expression, for example, um, the class of English starts at seven o'clock. Excellent, very good job. Oh, um, sorry. Um, I usually eat pavo, no digo pavo. Turkey, turkey. Turkey, turkey. Mm -hmm. yeah. I usually eat turkey at Christmas. At and, Christmas, excellent. And we use in for month, for season, for years, decades, centuries, long periods and parts of the day. Um, for example, my daughter was born in August. And Excellent. Um, my I I drink coffee in the in the afternoon. Okay. All time. <laughs> <laughs> and we use on for days, date, and parts specific of day. For example, the um, the class of English is on it starts on monday excellent of tuesday of tuesday to tuesday okay yeah. from monday to tuesday mm -hmm. mm. my birthday I birthday on five fifth October. Okay. And my birthday is my birthday is my on. birthday is mm -hmm. on fifth October. Okay, excellent. <laughs> now, uh, Maria, sorry, Mari, uh, did you remember this class or? Yes, yes. Ah, okay, okay. So explain me this class. When do we use frequency adverbs? Oh. Por ejemplo, la rutina. Okay. Mm -hmm. To talk about eh. routine. Example, um, I always wake up at six. Okay. Uh, my sister usually brush teeth at eight. Excellent. Brushes, remember brushes because it's brushes. third person. Mm -hmm. um, No remember often. Often it's like, um, I would say 70%. You don't do like all the time, but not 
Like it's must must come on then sometime. So maybe I often uh, drink milk because I don't do it every day, and I I do it maybe three days in the week. So maybe this can be a very good example of often. If you don't remember, don't worry. Continue with the other one. Maria, are you there? What about oh oh uh, the, the, the... just give me a sentence with never don't worry um to you. um how often you go the beach you go to the beach. You go to beach, sorry. You go to beach. Mm -hmm. uh, Sometimes, example. Okay. Um, I sometimes um, the the Monday I go the the church the church to the church okay to church the church mm -hmm. um uh, my mother hardly ever is Sad. Okay, that's something nice. Uh, my father ever is happy. <laughs> okay, the opposite. <laughs> okay. Okay, thank you, Mary. So now, uh, Alejandra, just explain me when do we use the third person rules? For three person in general, this for example, work, what it uh, is. So we you, we add S mm -hmm. to the yes. to the pronunciation of the words, right? Go work. work Works. Right? Okay. And mm -hmm. in which subjects or for which subjects do we use a, this rule? Subjects. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yes. Do you remember which subjects? I, you, we, they, he, she, it, which of them? Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you remember? Mm -hmm. For third person? Mm -hmm. which, which are the third person? The subjects, which are? He, she, it. Okay. He, she, and it. So if a sentence has, a, or if you are talking about he or she or it, you are going to use, or you are going to add the S. I mean, depending on the rule, right? But the pronunciation, you add the S. Goes, does. Does kiss kisses by buys stays stays okay 
Okay. And this is an example using a name, a proper name. Diana is she, okay? okay. And finally, this one. Just read it and, and try to remember uh, because we are going to use it for, the, for our activity. So, Mauricio. Yes. Uh -huh. I have a problem with this term. Why? <laughs> this topic. Why? <laughs> Cuando estaba haciéndolo en la, en la plataforma, tuve muchos problemas porque me... You, me you, <laughs> you got confused. Okay. Uh, which are the, uh, the ones that you think you confuse a lot. Mm, I confuse with the season. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So I can help you with this. Give me a sec. Oh, you are talking about the platform, right? Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, got it. Yes, I, I had another student that had the same problem with you. <laughs> Don't, so don't worry. It, it the sometimes the platform is kind of confusing, so don't <laughs> worry. But seasons mainly, maybe you have to remember that for this activity we are not going to use the adjectives that you you saw in the platform. So don't worry on the platform. Okay. So don't worry. But do you do you know the name of all of the four seasons? Come. Do you know the name of the four four seasons? Um, spring, winter, fall, and um, spring, winter, fall. Summer. Summer, excellent. So I, I will try to use this one. So you see, winter, you have snow. In spring, all the flowers eh, start. In summer, you know, it's like when you go to the beach, go to beach, sorry, and it's like too green. And in autumn, all the leaves uh, fall, okay? But in autumn, in rain? Yes, yes. But it, that's in, 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 in those type of countries. Especially in, in, in the United States, when it's the season, autumn or fall, they have rain, a lot of rain. Oh, that's not the one. So you have a lot of rain. So can you select the, maybe depending on the seasons, for example, hot, and maybe it could be summer and warm. Summer too. Summer could or be. Spring. Yeah, I think it could be summer, depending on summer. the weather. But if you are talking about, uh, yes, yes, use it in 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 summer. To don't confuse hot and warm to weather and cold. Mm. Autumn. Autumn. Mm -hmm. And freezing. Mm, the winter. Yes, cold could be because of the rain, autumn, in freezing, in the winter, right? Mm -hmm. In a tornado. I don't have an idea. <laughs> I think maybe uh, because the breeze, maybe in in fall, 
in orum maybe i don't know could be icy in winter okay thunder um i say orum because mhm mm so if i ask you how is the weather you can answer me with one of those. It's rainy, it's snowing, it's slitting, it's hiling, it's lighting, it's stormy, sunny, cloudy, party, cloudy, foggy, windy. And if you ask, how is the sky? Uh, you can say clear, uh, the, 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 the sky is clear, or oh, we have a clear sky, okay? So, uh, when I, I will ask you, how is the weather in autumn? In autumn, and um, rainy. Okay, and rainy. Possible stormy, lighting. Stormy, lighting. Uh, for autumn. If it is raining, what about cloudy? Um, rainy. Mm -hmm. I think it's also in in autumn because if it is raining, it's because they are it cloudy. it's cloudy. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what about in summer? No oh, clear sky. What's the weather. Okay, clear clear sky. Um, sunny. Sunny. Mm. I think okay uh -huh. and maybe they uh, there is a rainbow uh -huh. and for let me see winter winter um freezing freezing Icy. okay i see um snowy snowy Sleeting. Sleeting. I don't know. Uh, Highly. Yes. And windy. Windy. Yes. And maybe foggy. Foggy. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I think you 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 understand very well the the weather. So you just have to practice. Now, this is your practice, okay? okay. Uh, you have to suppose you are meeting new people. So you are you don't uh, meet. You will start the conversation, you introduce yourself, you ask about hobbies, whether favorite actor, actress or singer in a favorite place in the world, okay? You, if you want, you can take a screenshot. You meet a new person and you start a common conversation, okay? Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. How old are you? Uh, and, and you continue. And then you ask for your hobbies, the weather, favorite actor or actress or singer, and favorite place in the world, okay? Take a screenshot and I will send you together, I think, again. Are you ready? Do you have any doubt? Yes, yes, yes. Um, okay. Give me please an example for the weather. Oh, um, maybe you can talk, oh, it's, too freezing, uh, maybe because it's it's winter, and no, I don't know something like that. Or you can ask, oh, and how is the weather in your country? Let's suppose you are in El Sa you are from El Salvador, and the other people is from United States. How is the weather in in winter, or how is the weather in autumn? Something like that. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So if you don't have any doubt, go.
Siri. Sí. Okay. Hi. Hi, Mauricio. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. Hi. And you? Okay. Okay. Mm. Mm. Tell me about. <laughs> um, I I am thirty three years old. I I have do two jobs. I I am driver. I am delivery biker. Um, I don't have hobbies because uh, never have a time, but hardly ever um, I I exit for the city and uh, the camp or um, um, <clears throat> for a mountain mm -hmm. is my I love the mountain the, the green for the tree um, I love the the cold. Um, I like the 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 weather. Um, crazy. I love that. Um. Is so tell me about you. How about you? Hi, my name is Alejandra. I'm 25 years old. Actuality is work. And, and I take a class. My hobbies are walk. I like walk. I like I like it. I like it. Like song, I watch series. Mm. 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 Escuchar. Escuchar. Listen. Escuchar. Hear. Or listen. Listen. I like listen. Music. Mm. Mm. In the world, my favorite world is winter. Winter. Um, green. Green. Mm. My favorite actress is. And Stan and Ryan Goldstein, <laughs> my favorite place in the world is Brazil or Spain. Spain. Yes. 
personas. My favorite actor is Will Smith. <laughs> in my favorite place in the world, Holland. Um, Mari Mejia. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mari. Um, I have uh, 32 years old. Um, I have uh, six brothers. Uh, my my hobby favorite my hobby favorite is play soccer play soccer in the weather the weather is winter winter um, cold thunder I like Mm. My favorite actor is Henry Cavill. Uh, in my place in the world favorite is Paris. It's Paris. Okay. <laughs> I go to travel for Europe. <laughs> oh, hello? Vamos a hacer excursión por Europa. <laughs> okay. Uh, only... Okay, so we are going to return to come back to our main station and then we'll finish our class, okay? Okay. Give me a second. Wait for me. It appears that you are in room two, but you are not in room two. So I suppose you never go. So uh, I think that's, oh, sorry, my camera. <laughs> Give me a second. Okay, that, I think that's all for it, the class. Um, tomorrow we are going to start another uh, basic and I hope uh, I would say more English for you uh, because you know it, it doesn't make sense that you are advancing talking about levels but you are not practicing English uh, you are not get getting fluency so since let's see we are going to start our next level tomorrow and we are going to push a lot. So you are going to practice more. You are going to speak a lot. And um, so I will see you tomorrow. I, I appreciate that you are here in the class, uh, your participation, and your, that you are paying attention. So thank you for all, and I will see you tomorrow, okay? Bye, guys. <laughs>